This fire service demonstration shows the danger. Many skin creams contain paraffin. If absorbed into clothing and exposed to a cigarette or flame, it can lead to this. She's looking frail there, isn't she? These sisters lost their mum, who used an ointment containing paraffin. My mum should been using um, paraffin-based creams for many years. These creams, once they're soaked into the fabrics, and they can stay there. She'd either dropped a cigarette or dropped a match onto a bedding, uh, which unfortunately um, the creams sped up and increase the flames of flammability. Paraffin creams are safe. It has well-proven therapeutic qualities used in some moisturisers, antiseptics and cleansing lotions. There's no legal requirement for a fire warning on packs. Some creams have it, others don't. It needs to be highlighted and quite direct for someone to understand it. Not to go into too great depth, but do to get the message across. There have been 44 fatal fires since 2010, where it's suspected paraffin-based skin creams played a part. It's now known around 95% involved cigarettes. The fire victims have been aged from their late 60s to their 90s. Today it became clear change is coming. All of these products will carry a fire risk warning. Experts, officials and the industry are working on clear, consistent wording. But it will take time. I am from West Yorkshire Fire Service. Fire officers are now making trips like this, asking pharmacists to warn buyers as well. How do you respond to what the industry has said today, which is that warning labels are coming? We want it to be done as quick as possible so people are made aware of the potential fire risk. And also we want that wording to be clear and consistent across all products. These creams can bring great benefit, but soon there'll be more information on where they can contribute to tragic harm. Chris Choi, ITV News, West Yorkshire.